Okay, now I'm going to do the, uh, the edge work and the indirect, I mean the uh, notches. This is just a, a black leather pad so I can actually see what I'm doing. This is uh, absorbing all the shock here. The black allows me to see what I'm doing a lot better. See if that distance is, is right. All right. Now these two, I have two pressure flakers. There's a little bit of difference between them. This one's got kind of a rounded end, and this was squared off. Now this one is better for notching. It, it puts a lot more pressure on the stone when you use a corner like that and it's much easier to remove a flake. This one is rounded more for my edge work. Now I got to be careful because I can easily snap the tip off. I work on my knee because it has a natural curvature and I put the point on the top of the curvature so that the only pressure really is directly under where I'm using my tool. See if we can get this centered. And at this point it's just shaping it. I'm not really trying to thin it. I'm not driving flakes, I'm just shaping it, another arrowhead for comparison. Looks like it'll be approximately the same size. I've studied, I've had a chance to look at some real ones and the finish work is so amazing on the real ones. So carefully done, it's amazing. Of course there are some points that are crude, quickly made, but there are some that are just amazingly well done. So I, I shoot for I shoot for halfway between sloppy and good. <laughs> oh, there I go. Got a leak. Let me take a break here.